Hey guys, welcome back to Vlogmas. So I actually just got off work and I have to go run some errands. First stop is PetSmart. I have to get my cat some treats, Levi specifically. He um, has been having some play aggression issues in the morning. So I need to like really get on giving him treats when he's playing with toys. I need to start like, playing with him at night because he does this thing. It's really like terrifying where I'll be sleeping in bed. He doesn't do it to my husband at all, it's just me. So I'll be sleeping and he'll come into the bed only if Kiyomi is not around. And he'll be purring all sweet. And I'll wake up because I'm honestly like traumatized from what he's done. So I know that word is so dramatic, but it's so true because I wake up knowing he's in the bed and it's not Kiyomi and I start petting him and there are instances where he will just start attacking me like he'll go to bite me he'll pounce and it's just so scary and terrifying because I'm like half asleep if you have cats and like have gone through this like please tell me what uh, can help because it just sucks like he used to be able to cuddle me and whatnot and that's not a thing anymore so yeah I have to just start rewarding him and give him more attention Maybe it'll stop. So I'm gonna go and go into PetSmart and get this guy some goodies. Pumpkin tummy toppers. I got this last time. These are soft and chewy. I feel like I could get messy if I'm carrying them, so I'm gonna go with the reliable one. I know really likes these. I love that it says born carnivore. It's so cute. I forgot that Levi could use me cooker toy. They have this. I don't know if I want that in my home. Absolutely not to this one. This one's cute. All these fish. I'm an old baby just looking around. I have some like cash that they give you like a $10 off. $25, so we'll see if I find any gifts. Ooh, this is cute. This is cute too. I'd like to get into like this kind of Christmas, colorful Christmas. I spent forever in Old Navy, but I did come out with some things. I'm gonna go into Sally's, it's right behind me and get this co-wash for my hair because I'm still going through the dermatitis. They didn't have the product, but it's fine. Um, I'm going to Aldi, right there, to get some meat. And then I'm actually going to meet Michael at Firestone. Um, he called me, so we're gonna go on a little adventure together. I'm very excited. I don't know what we're gonna do, really. Who knows, might even go out to eat. I don't know what's gonna happen. for like my craft stuff organize something <laughs> look at the jelly bean dispenser oh my God. Ah, it's like the house points yeah. that's where i want to be the bakery we're Romance. having ourselves we're ha <laughs> sorry we're having a pizza night very exciting we got mango passion fruit juice we have the game awards on Nice dress. She picked it. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Shmi over there. No, oh, sorry. There's a bunch of stuff on the couch. Good morning. Almost afternoon. It's around like 11.45. I have had quite a, I should call, productive morning. I have a bunch of laundry going. I put myself together a little bit. Um, right now, <laughs> my task is to upload part one because this is the part that I always struggle with. It took me a while to get here, but I'm finally in front of the computer. It's already uploaded. I just have to make a thumbnail and put in the music. I have to find like some pics. Hopefully I can find them. And then I will go on with the day and continue vlogging because 
I would not let myself vlog except for now until I uploaded this. Like that's, that's one thing that I'm trying to do, like a reward for myself, which I've had to do in the past. So I'm gonna get to work and then I'll see you guys in a bit. Mr. Kiyomi, he is enjoying his floor bed so much. Move over. It's time for us to cuddle. Come here. Show them your beautiful belly. Mm -hmm. That only took me two hours. I really need to take photos with my phone. So when I do that three photo thumbnail style, which I really like, I have photos that actually work. I included so many links. It was a lot, but that's the part of uploading videos that I really want to do um, because I feel like that is a part of like YouTube. Yeah, I just like to share things that I'm loving and this is one place that I can do it. I think I'll show you guys a little bit of this room. This is the office that I made and it's not like done. I mean, no room is ever done, but I really like what I did with it because it's like cozy. It's a multi-purpose room and this was actually my husband's game room. So, and then it was a guest room. Oh my god. The many versions of this room is pretty ridiculous to be honest. So here is an overview of the room and to the left I made this little lounge. Um, that is a queen, queen, oh my gosh, queen mattress. And this was a guest room, but we really don't have many guests. So yeah, that's the mattress topper. So I kind of folded it so it goes like this. So there's a nice little back cushion. This chest has a bunch of Ren Faire or costumes, just costumes, I should say, like just all of the fun clothing. And then over here are the desks. And I put mine in first. This is just all Ikea. And this actually cushion is like a perfect cushion. It has a hole for your tailbone, which I very much need. It's very nice. And I was using Michael's Secret Lab chair, which is a gaming chair. Very fancy. I got that for him for his birthday one year. But to be honest, I don't really edit in a rolly chair. So that's why I have this chair. And it's just the way I like to do it. I actually stole his lumbar cushion because... That was comfy. This office isn't meant for the two of us to be in together and on the computers at the same time. Um, yeah, that's just not what I've done. I'm always a person that likes to edit without headphones. I wanna know what it's going to sound like if someone's playing it on their TV or their computer. So yeah, I don't like wearing headphones. I actually have to go check on laundry because I forgot that there's like two more loads. And I think we're gonna do some like decorating because there's one thing I want to do to my Christmas tree. Welcome to our tree. So this tree is very small. I love her. Um, the lights on the bottom died. I don't know what happened but all of the bulbs are like black, so they all burnt out. It's, I don't think it's just one bulb. It was probably a cat, I have a feeling, because Levi likes to bite the tree. Who knows? I'm just speculating. My husband put on these lights on the bottom. I don't know if you can see, but they're not the right color. I didn't want them there, but appreciated help. We do have sprinkles of red throughout our decor, but I don't know, there's just something too much. I want a more wintry wonderland type of feel so I'm going to put on different lights and actually put on some fake snow. There's no snow outside which is kind of weird. I'm like waiting for the snow which is coming soon. So be prepared for some you know snow clips. We also have a timer this year which I don't know why like one of these things. We don't normally do that. We usually do um like a smart plug so I want to get that sorted because the schedule is a lot easier to manage on a smart plug you can set it to the days that you're home so your tree is on when you're home so my schedule changes all the time so that's why I need that I strung these lights vertically so it's really easy to take on and off 
do have to go around some ornaments, but it's fine. Alrighty, we have the lights. I'm gonna put these on and then start adding different things to the tree. Maybe I'll even take stuff off. I don't know what's gonna happen. Um, let's go. This is not enough light to do the vertical way, so maybe it's the same color as the tree. Why didn't I try that before? Ah! Oh my God. It is the same color as the tree. It's so messy down here. I just don't even know what's happening. I'm just not into this tree skirt as much. Now is the fun part. I have this stuffing that is from a pillow that came with our couch and I was just over the pillows, but they did not come in like another pillowcase. It was just the stuffing inside the pillowcase. So now I just have all this fluff for projects and I'm gonna stick them on the tree. It might be really annoying to get them off, but whatever, I really want a snowy tree, so we're just gonna go with it. It's a nice little fluffy clouds. I'm gonna have them kind of go long ways, so it's like, it's resting. Resting, oh my god. just made myself a little coffee. It's this little gray one. It's like a five ounce Rondio. This is our little haul from last night. Um, we went a little crazy at the grocery store. Michael never goes to the grocery store, so he never gets to encounter these like treats. So we got these like croissant muffin things, um, strawberry, and then this is a Danish. Oh my gosh, the washer is so loud. <laughs> But yeah, the Danish is a little different because it has like a braided bready. And then these are butter cookies from Aldi. I'm going to have one. They're so thin and crispy. These cookies are like little people. This one looks like Trump. <laughs> Do you see what I'm seeing? The hair. inspired by this tree. It's kind of a mid-century modern vibe and I really want a colorful tree so that's what we're going to do. I'm not sure if we'll end up going to the store and getting like colored ornaments because it just looks so so beautiful. I love a bigger version so let's do this. So the tree is in the office with me. This tree needs some love because it was kind of like thrown together. Um, I have bunch of things to put on it that I think will fit the vibe. So the first thing is this, this um, pick, tree pick. And I'm going to cut it down with these cutters, pliers, so I can like stick them. Just gonna gosh, cut. I got eight sections out of that big pick. A feature banging, that's my husband in his man room. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. I call it his rock room because he works with rocks and stones. Um, so yeah, he's doing a project. When I plug these lights in, my brain just went PlayStation. So this is our little gamer nerd tree. I put a controller on top. Here it is with the lights off. It's Japanese kind of recording. <laughs> It wasn't recording. Oh. Why did it stop recording? <laughs> We're starting over. Japanese tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes. Is this the Chinese panda? I'm wearing gloves because I'm doing something separate. Mm -hmm. um, hello, Japanese Hello Kitty. Yes. Asian flowers. Oh my god. I know, I should have cherry blossoms. That'd be a good idea. Japanese controller. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what that ancient thing is. Oh my gosh. I'm just I like that I had the special solar one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is nice. There's one more person. Oh my gosh. There's one more person hidden. Togopi. Yes. I still know these names. <laughs> so it's the end of the night. I am so ready to wash my face. And I don't know if I'm doing dishes, like to be honest with you. I have to do a little bit, but I'm feeling something weird in my back right now. So I know I'm not going to last that long, I'm just being honest. Um, I'm gonna cook, 
go see if my husband wants some food because I have to like pull him out of the, the abyss, you know? Um, I'm feeling really good about filming, doing YouTube. Um, I know vlogging is just, it's a weird thing to do, I feel like, because it's not exactly like helpful content. I mean, it can be, but I do just enjoy sharing my life, documenting my life. Um, things I love do come up and I always want to show up as a, you know, positive light and just share my creativity with whoever wants to watch. I feel like my spiritual journey is, is helping. It's so weird because two weeks ago I couldn't imagine like vlogging. I was considering not doing vlogmas and here I am doing it. Nothing else is going on tonight. So I will see you guys in the next video and take care of yourself.